How's it going guys? Today, I'm back at the pond that I just right by my house and I've fished before. Um, I'm not really going to say what I'm planning to fish for today because it always the changes for me and usually I don't catch the fish that I plan to catch. But uh, I was here last night practicing. I got a new uh, bait caster, the Abu Garcia Pro Max. I was just casting on this and my friend actually caught a crappie so that kind of got me excited that there may be some decent fish in here so which I may catch crappie, bluegill, if there are any carp, I brought some bread, bass, just kind of gauge and see what I can catch. There were any carp in this area, they are now gone. I have a carp on. It has been so long since I caught a carp. No. No. I think it's off. No, it's still on. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's swimming right towards me. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's a good one. It's a good one. Come here. Oh yes, that is a good fish. I have not caught a carp in so long. It feels so good to have one on. Come here. Oh my gosh. Come here. Beautiful common carp. Attention on. Oh, look at that beautiful carp. Look at that. So I don't know how well you guys can see this fish. It is beautiful. Let's get the release on this fish. There we go. Wow, that was awesome. That fight was incredible. She swam right towards me. Uh, that's my first carp of this year. Oh, it feels good to catch a carp finally. Alright guys, so when I caught that carp on, I had a big old weight, which really helps with casting. And also to get that bait right to the bottom where the carp are feeding right now. And then further down the line, I have a just a red hook. And when I caught that carp on, it's just a couple pieces of corn. So One thing to make sure when you are using corn is Always make sure your hook is exposed so that you can get that initial hook set. Otherwise, the corn could be covering the hook, and then you can't you can't set the hook because the corn's covering. So always make that make sure that hook is exposed. So I'm happy to say that today went as planned. 
which is a first in a long time. I haven't caught a carp in a very long time. It felt so good to fight it, and it was it was really cool because it when I was as soon as I, I checked the line because it looked like the the tip was tipping a bit. I checked the line, and then I set the hook, and the the carp started swimming straight towards me. So I was just constantly reeling in. Twice I thought um, that I lost it, but it was just swimming straight towards me. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you on the next video of 365 Fishing.